It is currently 6.23 on the 8th day of Camp NaNoWriMo. I have written 9,965 words in total. And I am really enjoying what I'm writing today. I'm writing a snow day scene finally. And I got to participate in my first write-in, which I'm gonna have to have a badge for. I need to put that badge up on my buddy page. Um, and my link to that is always down below if you wanna become a buddy. Um, I really enjoyed the write-in and now I just wanna kind of binge some of them because I really like the style. There's just a lot of prompts that really helped me with my story. Um, and I'm gonna be probably using some of the methods that they used. So it was my first ever write-in and I really enjoyed it. But, and the way they did it was just so fun. The host gives you a prompt and then you have maybe like 10 minutes to write and it was really fun. So it was like sprints but also giving you some inspiration to add into your story and the prompts were just so fun. And so now I'm probably just gonna go into like the past ones that have been recorded and just start writing. I have 35 words left if I want to get to 10,000 words and my goal to catch up would be like 12, so I'm getting there. I just need to kind of just keep writing. Most of my vlog today, I am just excited to write and I'm finally writing my snow day scene and there's a lot of things that went into it that I got out of the sprint and write in that I didn't think was even gonna go into the story. So I enjoyed it. It's been a good day and I am gonna go and write now. And on the eighth day, he hit 10,000 words. I'm starting off today's vlog in the kitchen because that's where I've been doing writing. But just because the desk in my room is really uncomfortable. Uh, just the chairs and everything. And this is just a better seating for me. And I just wanted to start today off saying that yesterday I hit 10k, so excited, and I'm very close to catching up. Um, I wrote 2,000 words yesterday. I would like to write 3,000 today. I don't know if that's going to happen, but it's 12 o'clock, so I, I could try it. I don't know. Um, we'll see what happens, but I wanted to come here to say I opened up my document and I started laughing because I realized why I didn't finish writing last night and that was because I wrote a scene that just pissed me off but pissed me off because of what my characters were doing and I just couldn't continue because I was getting angry for my main character. <laughs> I I'm too emotionally invested in my characters, which is totally fine and good. I'm glad that I am, but I might be a little too much because they need to have this argument for a reason and for conflict, but I just want to protect my main character at all costs. I'm going to finish this chapter and hopefully write 3,000 words. So happy day nine of Camp NaNoWriMo. Let's get the day started. What's up guys? It is five o'clock and I have not hit my word count. My word count was supposed to be 1500 words, which was on the Nano website, but my personal goal was 3000 and I'm only at 1100. I'm pretty much finished the snow day scene. I just am writing the scene that goes before it. How I've been doing my writing is since I still have the first draft, I'm just going in and 
rewriting things or I have just been picking a scene and writing things out of order and that is not really working for me at the moment mainly because when I write a scene out of order I just forget that it's out of order and I just don't insert the key factors of oh if this is happening while well, there's conflict I need to address some conflict and so I just need to fix things. At the moment I am writing a scene that goes before the snow day scene. I have finished the snow day scene. I need to just look it over a little bit because I'm not sure if it's entirely finished but it could be. Um, but I kind of just spent like two hours taking a break and trying to go on a villager hunt in Animal Crossing because I'm trying to get Sydney. She came to my island in the tent and I asked her to stay but she kept saying no and I basically harassed her and she did not say yes so I'm just kind of on a villager hunt trying to find her. I have not found her and it's annoying but I need to keep writing and hopefully get to my word count. Today's reward I think is going to be a nap. I'm really tired today even though I woke up at like 10 30 um and then I started writing at like 12. Um I don't know I think I'm just a little tired today and I've seen a lot of people say that they've been taking naps so maybe it's just because I've just been writing I don't know. Um naps are always good but I need to write and then I might take a nap. And so that's my update for today. If I write anything, I hit a word count, I will obviously update you. You would think that rain would be the perfect weather to write in, but I have no motivation. I just hate the darkness. It just doesn't help me, my mood, anything. Um, and so today I've written 55 words and it is almost two o'clock. But a positive is that I hit 13,000 words yesterday. I ended up writing 2,000 words and there's a certain scene that I need to write today but I just keep putting it off. I don't know why. I just am. Um, so now I am attempting to finish chapter three. Um, chapter two. Is chapter two finished? It might be. I need to check. Um, but my goal for today is to finish chapter three and to write that scene that I keep putting off. Um, and yeah, that's kind of it for today. It's Friday. It is the 10th day of NaNoWriMo and yeah, it's raining and I just kind of want to go back to sleep basically. But I'm going to actually turn on another write in just like a pre-recorded one. They've been really helping me. So I'm just going to spend the rest of the day writing, doing some sprints by myself and just writing. What's up guys? It is Sunday. I think the last time I updated was on Thursday. Basically Friday and Saturday I didn't hit my word count. Friday I wrote a hundred words and on Saturday I only wrote 400 um, and then I came to the decision that I would change my goal. So my goal originally was to write 50,000 words but that's just not going to happen for me because I just need to be taking breaks and I just think that I can't write every day. Um, it just isn't good for me. And so I decided to have a goal of 35,000 words. So I'm almost at 1400 so it's very doable and on the Nano website it shows that I'm on track and so I think that this is just best for me. Um, and so my whole manuscript would be 85,000 words and I think that works for me. My draft is basically a mess now because I realized that I want shorter chapters and so I need more than 27 chapters and I'm doing the 27 chapters outline so just nothing is working but the 35,000 words is a perfect goal for me and I'm excited to write today. I just need a, I need a lot um, but it says I'm on track. I'll insert a picture of what my progress looks like right now. It's really good so 
I can still take breaks and I won't be off track and so I think that this is a better decision for me and I don't want to just like burn myself out. So that is the update for today. I'll update you guys later when I have hopefully hit my word count or just written anything today. What's up guys, it's Monday, it is day 13 of Camp NaNoWriMo, and I am just living my best life, and I am more involved in my story, and I've just been writing more. I really have done myself a favor by changing my word count on Saturday to 35,000 words. I've hit my word count every day because it's a thousand and some numbers, and I am just having a great time writing. I hit a little block because I realized that my book is set from 2019 over to 2020 and if I ever get published obviously I'll probably have to change some things but for now that's what the time frame is and I realized that I may or may not be writing about the current state of the world. I think I'm lucky enough that my book is going to end in February, so I might not have to worry about the pandemic. I'm not worrying about it writing-wise right now, just because I don't really want to think about it or write about it, but I did get to a point in the story where my character is celebrating New Year's Day, and he's like, oh yeah, new decade, we're gonna have a great year, nothing's going to ruin it, and I'm like, my guy, I'm really sorry to break it to you, but, uh, it ain't it. <laughs> Try again next year, man. <laughs> Having a great time. Writing sprints are my godsend right now. Brittany hosted some tonight with Peyton, and it was really fun to watch and just fun to write. I feel like I'm just having more fun with my writing where I don't have a set limit. Um, so every day that I was like, oh, I didn't hit my word count, I was low energy, but now I'm at 2,000 words and I might get to 3,000 and I'm just really having a good time today. Um, I did some writing sprints in the morning, just watching like a pre-recorded one and honestly, they're just helping me a lot. I might make a whole video about what helps me with writing, like if I'm stuck or anything because it has been helping for me and maybe that'll help some other people and yeah. Yeah, I've just been having a pretty good day. Um, I got most of my goals finished. Um, I had a bunch of scenes that I needed to do and I just have kind of been putting off that scene that I was talking about that I was putting off. I finally did the other day and I'm just so connected to my characters that as it was happening I was so nervous for him. Even though I knew it was going to be a positive outcome, I was just so nervous for him. Um, and I'm just enjoying how my book is going. My organization is trash. I've been worrying a little bit about if my chapters are too short and just how many pages they are roughly. And I just saw that Dabble has a feature at the bottom where it tells me my word count of each chapter or like each scene. It tells you how many pages that chapter would be. And I love that feature so much just because I've been so worried and I'm like, what are my pages? So I really enjoy that feature because I've been worrying that my chapters are like two pages long. But today I've been referencing To All The Boys That Love Before for chapters. I just wanted to see what the length of Jenny's chapters are and I can't believe how short they are. This is 71 chapters and they're pretty short. The Christmas scene is four pages long and that just made me really happy. I've been getting a lot of inspiration from this because I do a baking in my book and I may or may not like to eventually have like some recipes at the back because one of my characters 
Rose has a special recipe that she always makes and so I would love to get that recipe and be able to put it in my book. Um, but that is for the future and that is just what I've been doing today. My word count for today is at 2611. It is 1030 at night so I am hoping to maybe get to 3000. Um, I'm just finishing up a scene that I have been meaning to get to but I just haven't gotten to because I didn't have like a vision for it but now I do and I'm writing it. My official Camp Nano word count is 17,823 and my manuscript has 67,823. So I am totally close to 85,000. Who knows what's going to happen, but I'm vibing, having a great time. And that is my update for today. I will see you guys tomorrow to close out the vlog and then I have to edit tomorrow. I have been doing a good thing where I just edit along the week and that is helping me immensely. I'm gonna go and write for the rest of the night and I will see you guys tomorrow. What's up guys? It is Tuesday. It is the 14th day of Camp NaNoWriMo. It is 2 p.m. and today I hit 20,000 words. I hit my word count today. So far I have written 1,314 words and I'm going to keep going. Last night I hit 3,000 um, and I think it was like 3,600, something like that. And I've just been up since 9.45 and I just started writing at like 11. Um, there was a writing sprint going on and so I was watching that and I'm just having a good time. Yeah, I've just really been in the zone today. Training camp started today. Last night I was watching highlights from the Winter Classic because I have a scene in my book and so I was just having a good old hockey time. And I've just been drinking some iced coffee and writing. I would like to hit 3,000 words again today. Um, so I'm going to write, see if there's any like sprints because that is just what really helps me. Um, and yeah, I'll just update you guys later and that'll probably be the end of this vlog.